so hello guys so in this video we are going to see how to run a BLDZ motor a brushless DZ motor or a quadcopter motor using a servo tester so here I am having a servo tester a brushless DZ motor which is connected to a electronic speed controller and the outputs will go to a LiPo battery it is a 3S 12 volt 2.2 amps battery so it's a 3S 3 pouch cells connected in series in order to get an output of 12 volts so here we go so in this setup in this setup we will have to connect the signal wire that's coming from the ESC to the output of the servo tester so here in the output section you can see it's a VCC signal wires and a negative so the negative will go to the negative and the positive will go to the positive and the signals will go to signal white is the signal and the red is the positive and the black is the negative so here I have connected it so now comes the input of the electronic speed controller so the input will be connected to the, directly to the battery so as it's connected you can hear a beep coming from the servo tester so this is the beep of calibrating the motor so now the ESC and the motors are all calibrated and now we just need to turn them off in order to control the speed as you can see as I rotate the knob the motor starts to spin so here I have connected the signal wire coming from the ESC to the output of the servo tester the input is still empty so this input is used when we use the small servos 9 gram servos and to test them so we use this input in the case of small nanogram servos and uh, we use the direct input of the ESC when we use um, some, um, some powerful motors like this. So here we go. So actually this is a very powerful motor. This is capable of running up to a RPM of around 24,000 RPM. So as per the specifications, this is a 1000 kV motor. So that means it's capable of running up to 1000 RPM at 1 volts and somewhere around 6 amps. So this is how it works. And here in my case, uh, this at no load, the battery, I mean the motor is consuming around 4.5 amps. And at full load, the motor is consuming around uh, 6 to 7 amps. So that's it for today's video thank you guys thank you for watching this video so guys if you're watching this video for the first time please press the subscribe button and in order to get the latest notification of my video please don't forget to click on to the bell icon okay guys thank you for watching this video.